Hello everyone, welcome to Full Moon Movies. In the Name of the King is an action fantasy film that, while not without flaws, manages to deliver an engaging experience with its well-developed characters. The movie succeeds in bringing depth to its key characters, allowing the audience to connect with their individual journeys. One of the strengths lies in the character development, notably that of the protagonist, Farmer, played by Jason Statham. Farmer's evolution from a humble farmer to a hero on a quest is portrayed with sincerity. Statham's bring a level of authenticity to his character, making Farmer's motivations and struggles relatable. The audience witness his growth both in skill and in the understanding of his destiny, creating a character arc that is compelling. Key scenes that capture audience attention include the action sequences and epic battles showcasing the film's fantasy elements. The movie's contrast with others in the genre lies in its more grounded approach to storytelling, focusing on the personal journey of the characters rather than relying solely on spectacle. While it may not have the grandiosity of some fantasy epics, this decision gives the films a unique flavor. One major critic of the film revolves around its director, Ove Ball, who often been the subject of substantial criticism throughout his career. Critics have pointed out that Ball's filmmaking style tend to lack the finesse and depth expected in high-budget productions. His films, including this one, have been criticized for uneven pacing, questionable storytelling choices, and at times, subpar special effects. One of the main criticisms is directed at the film's ambitious attempt to bring a fantasy epic to the screen. Some argue that the movie falls short of delivering the grandeur and cohesiveness expected from a fantasy genre. The narrative, despite its character-driven elements, has been criticized for being convoluted and formulaic, lacking the intricate plotting and world-building seen in more successful fantasy films. In the Name of the King features an antagonist character portrayed by Ray Liotta named Galleon. Galleon is a sinister and power-hungry wizard who serves as a major adversary to the film's protagonist, Farmer, played by Jason Statham. The character of Galleon undergoes some development throughout the narrative, revealing facets of his motivation and dark ambitions. Galleon initially appears as a malevolent force, aligned with dark forces seeking to dominate the kingdom. As the story progresses, the audience learns more about his background, including his alliance to the film's primary antagonist, the evil wizard, and his desire to acquire and wield immense power. While the film doesn't delve into extensive character depth, it provides glimpses into Galleon's past, hinting at personal motivations that have driven him to embrace a malevolent path. In conclusion, In the Name of the King may not be a cinematic masterpiece, but its focus on character development, grounded storytelling, and commitment to its fantasy world make it an enjoyable watch. It stands relevant today as a testament to the enduring appeal of well-crafted characters and narratives in the fantasy genre.